to be a what do you need to know message forgetting oneself is on the bottom of the deck so a lot of you guys are forgetting yourself in a situation somebody said I'm not a psychic but I know exactly what you need so somebody here could be a psychic and they do know what you need or they're not but they're intuitive and they know exactly what you need Somebody's giving you the eye, and it's making them want you bad. I'm not taking that. So somebody here really is into magic. Like, not the bad kind, or it could be. I mean, take the energy how it resonates. But one snap of your finger, and this person can show you a thing or two. <laughs> okay. Gilded regret. So somebody here is very regretful about something in their past. Because you see how these antennas is coming up from her, her um, or him. It looks like a deity hill. It could be a shim. <laughs> but somebody here has a lot of things that has happened in their past. And look, five. That represents change. So there's going to be a change. Or somebody is changing for the better. High priest or priestess. So somebody here could be a tarot card reader. But like I said, you don't have to be a tarot card reader. But you are very highly intuitive. Native American. Somebody here could be Native American. Right in front of your very eyes. All you got to do is say the word. And somebody will show you a thing or two. So somebody here is needing to communicate is what it sounds like to me. Because maybe somebody is speculating some things because you are a high priest. They feel that they should fear you or you are, you know, something that is demonic. But somebody here do have a demonic deity attached to their energy. chains so somebody here like I said is is gripped with a lot of anger and regret somebody is feeling remorseful and they are wearing a mask somebody wants to feel okay but they're not okay this could even be mentally they're not mentally okay mm. okay sell out on the bottom of the deck some of you guys could sell products or whatever it is that you do do you're going to sell out in, in profit. Or somebody here really did sell themselves short. They sold their soul for wealth. And they didn't know that their soul was worth more than money. See, something is coming back full force. There's blood on this woman's lip. It looks like stab wounds. So somebody could be getting attacked by a deity. Somebody could be 29 years old. Somebody here could also be born on the 15th or born on the 5th. Somebody could also be born on the 1st or in the first month. This sign says can't live without you. I don't think I, mm, bad health. energy somebody could be literally trying to harm themselves to keep you from leaving them 
This could be a parent. It could be a child. It could be your lover. I hope this music is not too loud because I can't really hear it. But I'm completely deaf in my left ear. Occupation. So somebody here could be deaf as well in their left ear or completely deaf in your family. Somebody here is a hard worker. Somebody here... I have heard this song before. They can't live with themselves if they hurt you. So somebody here has hurt you and they can't live with themselves. But somebody here, like I was saying, is a hard worker. Somebody here, even if it's your child or you, you custom make your outfits, you sew. You could even do like crocheted outfits and then you sew them together. Or you could just use a sewing machine to do whatever it is that you are branching or a branding, excuse me. And 34 is here. So somebody here could be 34 years old. Lovers. So somebody here has a decision to make. Somebody could be dealing with a Gemini or you have it anywhere in your birth chart. Somebody is aligning with a sacred lover. This is going to be your life partner. Mm, another five, mature man. So somebody here has matured over the years and out of, you know, life's experiences. So angel number five, five is here. Look up angel number five, five. Look up angel number 1555 as well. to be a power couple. Somebody is going to be a asset and not a li liability because toil and labor. Somebody here stands out. You know, you stand out in whatever it is that you do because you bring light. You bring joy. You bring knowledge. You bring, you know, your divine essence. Nobody can do what you do. You have the blueprint to whatever it is. I don't care if you do hair and somebody else comes along and they want to do hair too. There shouldn't be a competition because only you hold your life codes to your DNA, okay? Mature woman. So somebody here could be in the same field as you or they're just, you're in a competitive field. Mature, mature woman, like I said. Somebody here is going to be a vibrational match to you. Somebody is going to be like the direct opposite of you. Like you're going to meet somebody in another form that is the masculine version of you. If you are a woman and if you're a man, you're going to find a woman just like you that is a feminine. Or you have found. Thirty-eight um, is here. I already said that. So look up angel number three hundred and thirty-eight. Oh, there go your confirmation. Okay, I don't even know these songs. We've only just begun. I think I didn't know this song. I just came for real here. Okay, community, and this is thirty-nine. So, somebody's community could be against someone aligning to a, um, a higher level commitment with someone, or this could be a community that this couple is held in high honor. It's something that you guys do for work that is significant, that is going to bring in a divine union, a healed divine union. Yeah, gift on the bottom of the deck. 
mastery. And it says you've learned this spiritual lesson. So somebody here has learned a spiritual lesson. Something is definitely gradually growing because this is 38 and this is 39, toil and labor and community. So somebody's community, this could be a family uh, community, a church community, anything like that. They have done a lot of work to try and manipulate a situation. But you have learned a, a, a lesson, a spiritual lesson out of this situation. We've only just begun. Somebody got a lot of love to give. It never amazes me how ancestors show up. Vulnerability. Okay? Somebody, you are needing to be completely vulnerable with this person because you can trust it. Maybe you have come, you know, across a lot of narcissistic women in your life. And so you think that a specific woman is the same way, but she's not. She's not like this community said. Your union is going to be protected and is protected, and so are you. You are protected individually, okay? Somebody here could be playing hard to get, okay? Somebody is playing a lot of mind games, and you're going to end up losing here. Somebody has a lot of love to give. Apologize. Oh, it's a apology, but excuse me. Apologize, though, like I said. <laughs> you can expect the apology you want to hear. So somebody is going to apologize because this is a destined partnership. It's fated to happen. Somebody is involved with their twin flame. And somebody may be feeling guilty that they are releasing a soulmate to come in union with their twin flame. But a lot of these people in this community is going to have to accept it, okay? And so is this person. Somebody has to rise to their divinity, okay? Yeah, because there's definitely a high priestess in the background or a high priest that is doing a lot of manipulating. Because, look, page of swords. This is malicious gossip. You know, inaccurate information being spread amongst a group of people. Fix the swords in reverse to keep someone from moving forward on their destined path. Mm. The devil and then the ace of pentacles and justice. Oh my goodness. Somebody here wanted you to be on a hamster wheel. They wanted to keep you like a puppet on a string. Oh, you can't do that. You're going to go to hell. When they don't even believe in the hell that they speak of, they just want to keep you in that illusion. Okay, you guys? Somebody is needing to learn to build your own stability. That way you won't be codependent on anyone so that they can keep you stagnant or stuck. Your justice is here. Okay? Somebody is having a mirror effect with their twin okay somebody here is also copying your divine feminine if you are in a relationship with a karmic this person is trying to okay if if your divine feminine has black hair she's going to switch from brown hair to black hair or if your divine feminine has brown hair she's going to switch from black to brown you get what i'm saying somebody is a copycat the world that's why things are going to change here this is a destined change somebody is going to be doing some traveling as well somebody has decided to emotionally walk away because they are unfulfilled and they are very heartbroken they feel like their heart is being ripped from out of their chest they feel like these cracks and their foundation is going to eventually fall. I'm surprised the tower didn't fall out. But then again, here you go. The high priestess. So somebody is very secretive. Somebody is very skilled. Okay? So y'all need to be mindful of who you guys are connecting to. Like I said, somebody could be a reader. You guys need to be mindful of who you 
watch when you're watching tarot because some of these people are only in it for the money and they are you know giving you inaccurate information not only that but they are trying to tarnish your journey because their journey was already ruined by their own hands so they're just like i'm gonna keep getting their money and and hey fuck them and feed them beans excuse my language i'm just saying a lot of people are only out for themselves and y'all are going to start to see that I'm going to get some names. This is going to be first, middle, or last names. Clear, honest, and accurate names. Source. Tender kisses. So somebody here wants to give you tender kisses. I'm dead. on the um, community board and things like that. I said community board. I didn't even mean to say that. The um, description box, but I'm not going to do that. Kenya. Sheila. Oliver. Edwards. Evelyn. Warren. Boyd. Morgan. Patterson, Benton, well, Benton, so you guys can see it, Renee, London, Keita, Hines, Stefan, D'Angelo, Sullivan, Collier, Quinn, wow, Leanne, Zane, Diane, Nash, this name always comes out, Hernandez, Rebels, Isha, Cole, Teresa. Did I say Anne? And Tim is the last name out. Thanks for